The government told me, me, my kids, their kids, and their kids would be rich. I went to high school down the street. I went, I went to Little Prairie High School, and the last day they put a sheet right in front of me and they say, sign. I'm 18, I'm a little 18 year old boy. And I say, I'm gonna sign because I need to, I need to be rich. And now look what happened. Now look what happened. This this loser comes and talks to me and they say, we want to know what it's like for the kids today and their loans. I never had loans. He's a boomer behind the camera. Ha ha, okay boomer. So he's a, some loser behind the camera is telling me, oh, I gotta, I gotta film you and talk about your loans. Okay, fine, they're coming today. I've got a 12 year old daughter at home. She reads the newspapers or whatever they do, look on their phone at the TikTok. She says I lack empathy for what I do for a living. I say I don't go do work. You don't have that phone. You need to understand the situation. There are rules in place as a society where if we don't follow those rules, if we don't make our payments, things fall apart, chaos rules. And it's, it's not that I lack empathy, it's that I think they lack a little bit of understanding and, and frankly, I blame the parents. Something every week he comes, every week he comes. Here, he's coming again, here, he's coming again, watch. Hey. Hey, hey man, hey. Are you the one they call the student? I guess that's me. Great, great. How are you doing? I'm tired, man, I'm tired, I'm tired of you tired of me? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I am. Hey, let me ask you a couple questions, all right? I, they use the term debt collector. It's frankly unfair. I'm a debt counselor. I'm, I'm here to talk to you. Do you have a family? No, I can't afford it. You can't have a family, okay. Do you, get, you got friends, you got anyone that cares about you? Yeah, I got a mom, I got a dad. They want me to pay the loans. You want them to? Come and find me at a fucking park, man. Yeah, I can't even sit here. This is what they do. They bother me. I'm just out here uh, having a... What do you want? Son! What do you... Son! Are you my coach? What do you do for a living? This guy's my high school basketball coach. What do your parents do for Oh, no, he's a football coach. He's the coach. You put Jimmy at tight end sophomore year. You know what he's doing now? Oh. Yeah, yeah. You know what he's doing? He goes online. Jimmy Lozano. He, listen, listen. He goes online. He types in jobs. Click, 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 click. Clicks, clicks, clicks. He goes on all of them. You know how many jobs he's got? Goose egg. You know why? He just likes talking to interviewers. Look, don't listen to fucking Jimmy Lozano. What, what, what did he do with his life? Yeah, 4.0. Yeah, and what, fucking basket weaving? Oh, that's a real good one, real cliche. Yeah, you don't get out of your basement, do you? You go on the forums, you got your 60-year-old grandma sharing a bunch of shit, that's what you do all day. What do you do for a living? I'm, uh, I do things, you know? I, uh... Right. Go to any time? I didn't know you worked at any time. Oh, you didn't know about this. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know about this. <laughs> I, ever since you cut me, you asshole, I'm training every day. I go in, I do, I do five days a week at the gym. Uh, I'm competing, you know. You know, they give me a few dollars. I go, I, I train other people. So your job is to train? Yeah, you know this, you know this. What you, are you training you know, for? You cut me, you cut me, you asshole. What are you, what are you training for? You know what you're training for? You're training for life. These are life lessons that you need to learn. And one of them is to pay your bills. We're gonna leave this little interaction here. And in some way or another, the government's gonna get paid. There's a system in society 
where people get society. paid. Society. People get he paid. He thinks he's smart now. They gave him a job teaching history. They said, hey, asshole, go teach history because you're so fucking dumb. Let me tell you what I told me a linebacker. You said you're going to get a scholarship. Oh, he's going to get a scholarship. Four years. We're going to put him on the line. You're going straight to Ohio State. And nope. Look at me now. Look at me now. He comes and bullies me for this shit. Look, if you'll shut your smart mouth for 10 seconds. You'll be worried about your next latte, and the government is going to get paid, and I will get paid for this service, and you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to buy a jet ski. I'll explain it to you in very simple terms. You don't need a college education for this. Here, you, you, need, to, you need to see what I'm writing here. This is the number. You know what? It's so big, I don't even need to write it. I don't even need to write it. It's so big. I know. It's zero. I know. You know the number? Yeah. And how much is your monthly contribution to that? You're not getting the money. There are mechanisms. You can't mess with the laws. Bob, you sit here. You remember about the days when you used to play catcher on the old ball field here. I'm still making gains, man. You're still making gains. <laughs> I'm still making hey, gains. Hey, how much man. you lift? How much you bench? Four plates. Easy. Any you add those type four, of lift. Add those four plates together, that's what? Two, three hundred pounds? British pounds, convert that to dollars, you might get two percent of your debt paid. <laughs> No, he's smart now. They give him a history job. So yeah. get off the field, idiot. You need a job. It's, it's called the pound sterling. They use it in England where people pay their debts. Here you got a bunch of low lives leeching off the government. All those yeah, fucking shut people. up, coach. Shut up. You yeah, I've seen you with your pants down on the sidelines yelling at some fat 16-year-old all week. You know what? All those fucking places. You don't pay your bills, you get your fucking hand cut off. Put that. Latte down. Fucking clown. It's a basic rule. Hey, look, I'm a gentleman. Here, come down to Anytime Fitness. Come down. Come down. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You see what he does? Look at this. Look, look at this. it's I not that I. It's this. not that I don't. It's not that I lack empathy. That's it. I'm cool, I'm man. I'm still cool. Guy. Times are tight. I'm going to get Jimmy. I'm going to get him. You stay right here. Right here. You know, I, 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 I teach history. I teach world history. Um, but you know, you get this stereotype. You get this horrible stereotype of, oh, he's a jock, so he's dumb. Oh, you know, they're, they're, they're taking the geology class. It's rocks for jocks. Geology is a noble discipline. You have to know about the minerals of the earth that we stand upon that form this experience we have of living on this great planet. And you know, I teach history because I want to teach these, these young people something about the way things used to be, something about how they're going to be in the future, which is that when the numbers don't add up, when you have the five zero 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 and you can't pay it off, it's not gonna be a happy ending. You know, I can't talk anymore, I'm getting tired. Uh, it's just insulting, it's, it's sad.